Hi everybody, this is Tim Kelly with BirthdaySHOES.com. Here we are taking a look at two pairs of shoes from Scora. Uh, Scora is a brand new company and their tagline is Run Real and their website is ScoraRunning.com. Uh, they have a pretty slick little, little shoe box here. Uh, it actually uses a magnet to keep the, uh, to keep the box shut, uh, which is which is a fun little fun little feature that you can tell that they thought about a lot of the details. Uh, so on the left here we have the model which is called the base and here on the right is the form and they are virtually identical um, in terms of the sole you can see you can see it's just a slightly different coloring used there um, and it's the the uppers that are the only difference. Um, so let's let's take a look at the uh, the base model here. Actually reminds me a lot of a cycling shoe uh, in terms of looks, partly because it has uh, just one one strap here, which kind of looks like a uh, kind of looks like a triathlon shoe. But you use that to tighten and loosen it, and it also has a uh, elastic velcro heel strap to uh, tighten up the shoe around the uh, around the heel. Uh, the upper is quite thin, quite breathable there above the toe box and um, much thicker and padded at the back. Uh, the base uh, feels like it's made from you know, completely synthetic materials and there is actually quite a bit of um, padding, although it is a zero drop shoe. Um, it doesn't, you know, it's, it feels like it's much thicker than, say, a pair of uh, Vibram Five Fingers. Uh, let's see, let's take a look at the, the insole is removable, and it actually has I don't know if you can really see here, probably not, but there are uh, little raised little raised bumps all, all through it uh, which give um, a little more traction uh, to, to the foot. So let's stick that back in there. Now let's move on to the form. So the form is interesting. It's actually uh, the upper is actually made from uh, high-quality goat leather, and uh, it also has the elastic Velcro strap on the back. And the laces uh, are slightly different than what you'd uh, than what you see on most other shoes. These actually are asymmetrical, with the laces kind of following the the curvature, the groove of your foot. Um, and this also has the the tongue, which is you know connected to the rest of the upper there on the, the left side, but uh, open there on the right. Again, uh, zero drop zero drop heel. There is a the only noticeable difference is that there's a bit more of a toe spring to the base model there. If you can see that, you can see where it curves up quite a bit more. I'm not sure if that's um, due to a more rigid uh, upper on the, the form or what's going on there. Uh, but the shoe is it's, it's fairly flexible. Um, you're not going to curl it up and roll it up into a ball like you'd see with a pair of five fingers or with um, some of the uh, shoes from uh, Lemming, formerly known as Stem. Um, but still, a uh, fair amount of flexibility. These uh, they come in a couple different colors. Uh, there's the the silver and the blue, and in the in the base model and in the form model, there's a uh, there's also a red, red and silver model. Um, so yeah, uh, we'll take these out for a little bit of running and uh, let you know how they feel. All right, thanks a lot.